also love her father i mean the way he teaches music and uh, i'm also i'm fine ma'am what about you i'm doing good thank you so much uh, do you remember me we had i think I two remember. sessions previously absolutely a very interesting topic today have you gone through session notes uh no actually i mean i i had joined that uh, i mean i was in the waiting room and then immediately i got a call so i answered it and i was having my having a conversation with my sister uh, for a couple of minutes and then i joined uh, this session yes the last session also you had a class with me yeah, yeah with you <laughs> yes yes that was financial management and okay this one is i think i had talked about financial management not uh, that session wasn't with you uh, mm-hmm. there was someone else i mean uh, the same uh, tutor from clapping go uh, okay so what is the topic for this session it's outer space or deep ocean uh i have i have talked about the these topics uh, previously you was right <laughs> to the chat support then you being sent similar topics again and again <laughs> yeah yeah definitely let's talk about something else i mean i am free to talk about uh, anything that comes up absolutely mm. so what would you like to talk about uh ma'am i would like to first of all i would like to know about you because in our previous sessions that we had together uh we had not shared uh, i mean we had not uh, introduced ourselves well <laughs> Okay, so what do you want to know about me? My name is Bhumita Mitra. Yeah, yeah, I know that. And I uh, came from Kolkata. I'm born and brought up in Kolkata. Okay. All right, that's information, is it? Mm-hmm. All right. And uh, about your passions, about your educational qualification. All right. So I have uh, pursued my education in Kolkata. So I've completed okay. my masters in bioinformatics. and then i have pursued my mba bioinformatics <laughs> i yes. have not uh, uh, come you across have not heard this about this before. subject no no what it's about it's very interesting you know it's very interesting the subject and when i took up the subject uh, there was no future in india because it was okay. a very upcoming subject mm. and this related to biology yes but the analysis of uh, human body to informatic system that's okay. through computer and software so whenever a doctor uh, gets a client a patient you know the patient might be complaining about different causes health issues mm. and he may not be able to figure it out so it's way like you know you feed the whole system with all the information and whichever malfunctioning is happening in the human body you can understand it through analysis and then at the dna level you can bombard that gene and you can take it off forever my god so it is totally related new. to gene therapy and drug designing and then the research all of it that's good you're a scholar ma'am <laughs> oh no no <laughs> absolutely not then you did and your then, mba <clears throat> yeah i did my okay. mba and then i did a little bit of digital marketing stuff also i did it i did my a God. pg diploma in digital marketing <laughs> so uh, <laughs> sorry I mean, my friend as you have done a pg diploma in uh, digital marketing are you working in that field or not little bit okay i okay. i have just started off during the covid times so i'm a fresher in that field okay the digital field but not okay. in the marketing <laughs> Okay, okay. So and, I had my uh, taste about... of marketing with education system. Okay, and what about clapping or tutoring? Ah, I love teaching. Okay. So I wanted to, you know, interact mm-hmm. with people and wanted to pursue the education. You know, my my uh, area of education has become a little bit mixed up with uh, academics and admin both. so i wanted okay. to meet people and you know explore this side of the world yes, as yes. well yes 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 so. that's great i am uh, uh, you must be speaking uh, bengali right i speak many languages because i had an opportunity to live in various states in india 
Oh my God, that's great. Uh, but your mother tongue is Bengali, right? My mother tongue is Bengali. I love that language because you know it is considered as one. Uh, it is considered as the sweetest language in the world. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> yes, yes, I mean uh, I was uh, before I joined your station uh, when I was uh, in the waiting room. <laughs> we were talking about Bengali. Bengali. Yes. <laughs> yes. So before I uh, joined this station, I mean when I was uh, in the waiting room. So I thought it's better to watch something, and I was watching. Uh, you uh, must know that person, uh, uh, Mr. Ajoy Chakraborty, Koshiki Chakraborty's father, and he was delivering a lecture on music and sadhana and all. So, yes. uh, and he often talks in uh, Bengali. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, even Koshiki uh, sings a lot of ragas. I follow her very frequently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she's a very good singer. I'm, yes, yes, yes. Hi. I love her singing and uh, I also love her father. I mean, the way he teaches music and uh, he runs, actually he is doing this wonderful activity, uh, not activity, let's say uh, one of the major initiative in case of uh, music learning and teaching. So he uh, teaches online uh, and uh, it is something called as Sudarshan music, music for all. Hmm. So I mean, are you interested are... in music? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I have been going to the training of uh, class Indian classical music, and yes, I am interested in raga music especially. <laughs> nice. You yourself hmm. are very talented. <laughs> no, very no. creative. Uh, so actually, uh, apart from that, uh, I mean, uh, as I'm on clapping, go learning you know, uh, speaking skills. So uh, uh, being a student of literature, I, I, mean, I love reading. So let's talk about uh, reading and books for the rest of the time. <laughs> what sure. do you think? Sure, sure, absolutely. <laughs> so what do you like to read? I mean, I love each and every genre, uh, right from poetry to novels. And I also read newspaper articles you know during covid i i had started this wonderful activity i used to read four newspapers and one magazine and those four newspapers were from different countries i mean one was uh, the guardian and it is published mm -hmm. in uk uh, mm -hmm. second was the new york times uh, it mm -hmm. it is published in usa and uh, the magazine uh, that i used to read was the new yorker that is also published in usa and the mm. few, uh, the remaining two newspapers uh, were from uh, India. Uh, first one is the Hindu, you know that. And second one is Lok Sattva. It is, uh, it's a regional newspaper that is published in uh, Maharashtra. Maharashtra, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I used to read these newspapers, and, you know, especially the editorial page, because I love the opinion section of the newspaper. Mm. And uh, yes, <laughs> I mean, you know, uh, at that time I found this, wonderful connection i mean <clears throat> when uh, new york times comments on indian issues it takes that uh, you know a journalistic freedom and mm. uh, times of india comments on us issues then it takes that journalistic freedom but whenever they talk about the issues in their own country they don't take that you know freedom just because the political parties uh, might abuse them <laughs> something like that Absolutely. So they have got mm -hmm. different perspectives for different uh, issues and yes, different yes. areas, the way they look at it. Absolutely. Yes. And what do you love uh, reading? I Currently, I am into mythology. So I don't know. Oh. I love the reading. I'm a voracious reader. I've been mm -hmm. reading novels, books, all of it. But currently, my interest is inclined towards mythology. Okay. I don't know why. Mythology. <laughs> That's so great. That's mythology, great. yes. So I'm trying I also, to... Yes, please. Yes, yes. I was also reading about Greek mythology because, you know, we have to study it uh, just because it's a part of our curriculum. Uh, I'm preparing for UGC NET, English Literature, and mm. uh, they have included this, uh, I mean, Greek literature, Greek, and Greek literature is all about Greek myths and all. Mm. So that's why we have to study... <laughs> Greek mythology. You like to read about Greece? Uh, 
Greek means yes. Uh, Greek literature is a part of our curriculum. I mean, uh, English literature syllabus. Yes. Yeah, so uh, mm -hmm. during the time we were doing history, so I was very interested in different civilization. So oh. the Roman civilization, the Greece, yes, and yes, the Indus Valley civilization. So that that's also right, uh, right. a area of interest for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, there was and a point you... in my life I was not able to decide whether I should take up history or whether I should take up science. <laughs> you can do it right now because <laughs> <laughs> learning is an ongoing process throughout our life. <laughs> oh, yes, absolutely. So I was in love with all the subjects. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, same is the case with me. Uh, you know, uh, being an art student, I also read about science. Uh, I'm also interested in mathematics. Uh, mm -hmm. I mean, it's been uh, six to uh, eight years since, uh, I mean, I have not been studying math, maths as my, uh, you know, uh, as a part of my academic, but still I you know, study about uh, interesting facts about mathematics, then, uh, you know, the subjects, the topics like calculus, linear algebra, <laughs> I love reading, I mean, studying that. I was very good in maths. Oh. So one of my teachers, uh, she suggested I should take economics with maths. And the other teacher got really annoyed because from a long time, they wanted me to do biology as my major. Oh, ma'am, I have, I have done master's in economics. Really? <laughs> yes. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. Right Good to know. Yes, yes. And right now I'm pursuing uh, uh, master's in literature. Okay. Mm. Now I get it. Yes, we have uh, quite similar interests. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm, economics, mythology, reading, mathematics. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, what to do? Jack <laughs> of all trades, huh? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, yes. So, ma'am, uh, do give me uh, feedback because, I mean, uh, the session will be over with them. Within a couple of minutes, I think. Yes, yes, couple of minutes, absolutely. Yes, yes. So you want a feedback? Sorry, I didn't yeah, get yeah. you. You asked something from me. Is it a feedback? Yes, yes, yes. I want feedback for my uh, English. For oh, your English, your English is good. Your English is good. Keep working on it. But yes, uh, your pronunciation, I think you should work on your pronunciation. Yes, yes. And yes. sometimes you drag onto a word. Uh, like that. Okay. Once you finish okay, okay. the word, and then you say, uh, like you drag it. Yes, with yes, the pronunciation. yes. Th 